Hi there, my name is Jamie Clark. I'm here at the LiveOutThere.com tech shop. I'm here with our resident gear guru, Tyler Kosaka. Tyler, good to see you, bud. JC. Tyler, we get a lot of questions about insulated jackets. Talk to me a little bit about synthetic jackets. Well, they're great pieces for sure. So synthetic insulation is a little bit different from down. Right. It's basically a synthetic fiber that's sort of randomly interwoven amongst itself to trap uh, air, which you heat with your body, and traps the heat against it. Got it. Uh, there's lots of synthetic insulations out there. Some of the stuff that you're going to see, uh, well, in this jacket that you got on, I see that. you're going to see some premium synthetics that you'll see quite frequently throughout these brands. So examples would be Primaloft, like this one. There's Coraloft. There's Thermic Micro. Yes. A few other types that uh, definitely are going to have either uh, varying thicknesses of fibers to, to build in more durability. You might see some uh, hollow core fibers. Right. More efficient, again, at trapping heat as well as being a little more compressible. So now this is getting complicated fast, but what you're telling me then, when I'm looking for a synthetic, I want the higher quality synthetics like the kinds you were mentioning. That's right. So higher quality, you're just going to have better performance for its weight and thickness. All right. Now why would I pick a synthetic jacket over, say, a down jacket? Well, first one, a uh, big reason is down, uh, unfortunately, uh, is not so uh, usable when it's wet. Mm. So if you have wetter conditions or, for that matter, you're uh, doing something highly aerobic, turning out a lot of heat and sweat, right. down has the possibility of collapsing on itself a little bit, whereas the synthetic insulation is definitely not going to lose its loft. It's going to be thermally uh, efficient right through it. So good in wet conditions. Also, as you notice, this particular jacket is uh, very slimming even for you. I need that. It's uh, a continuous sheet. It basically will allow no baffles going across your jacket like you saw in the down coats. Right. So if I don't like the really big puffy look, Absolutely. I can get similar kind of insulation with a more of a sleeker uh, profile. That's right. You okay. never have to worry about shifting uh, insulation in these guys because right. oftentimes they'll actually bond it right to the face fabric. And as far as uh, cost goes, the synthetic you were telling me earlier being a little bit less expensive, say, than a down jacket, that might also be something Definitely. of interest. And so they're hydrophobic. You can Absolutely. get them wet and they're still going to be warm. Yep. It's a little sleeker in terms of uh, the fit. Yep. Uh, same kind of quality face fabric, so waterproof and uh, depending on if it's taped or not. But Absolutely, yeah. Still quality face fabric, and but not as compactable. Not quite, not as uh, much as down for its weight, uh, but they're getting awfully close. Mm. So uh, you still can carry these along. You can pack them along with you with uh, little to no bulk, but down is a little bit better in that respect. Nice. Insulated jackets. Synthetic. Get one for yourself. Now live out there.